Felicia, hello. Mr. Rogers, hi. I couldn't help but notice there's no bobbing for apples. Oh, yeah. Um, I decided that was a little bit dated, you know, a bit old school. I have a Richard Dreyfuss poster hanging in my garage. bright side to everything. I didn't get anyone, but there are hundreds of students to ask. Excuse me, is this the Pizza Student Association? What do you want? I'm here for the advisor training session. Natasha, why did you schedule it for our Halloween party? One of the things that every club has to do in order to get certified is to have their advisor officially trained by a certified expert. So, in order to get certified, you need someone certified to officially certify your official. It's kind of like the DMV for collegiate recreational activities. I'm sorry. I'm Mr. Rogers, advisor. I'm Mrs. Fenwick, nice to meet you. I enjoy her general appearance. Well, let's sink our teeth right into this. Let's get started. Okay. Hello, everyone. I'm Mrs. Fenwick. I'm here to help your advisor embody our motto, live, love, learn, and lead. That's a terrible acronym. Yeah, who came up with that? So one of the first things we do is teach our leaders how to mediate conflict between group members. So I'll need two volunteers, one male and one female. How you guys doing? I looked directly in the camera. Oh, okay. Yeah, um, I, didn't, I guess I never really got to tell you guys much about myself. Um, I like pizza, that's obvious. Um, I never got to tell you why I like pizza, or why I'm part of the PSA. Well, I guess you could say it all started maybe when I was around, when I was little in general. I never really knew my mom growing up. So my dad was a single parent, you know, but he was an attorney, so he usually had plenty of money, but being an attorney is a pretty stressful job. Like, really stressful. So, naturally, he'll come home and find some way to take his anger out. And the dog having ran away one week and never come back, I was usually the next best thing. But that doesn't have anything to do with, what I have, with why I like pizza. Yeah, why I like pizza? Um, occasionally my grandma would come over one day when my dad was knocked out drunk from beating the hell out of me and she would bring me pizza. That's why I like pizza. Grandma? Oh god. <laughs> Ugh. Why am I drinking this? I hate Starbucks. Okay, so the scenario is a little intense, but it's great to start big. So you, what's your name? Chris. Oh my god, where are your parents? Um, yes, Patrice Richardson. Richardson, yeah, son Richard. You have been accused by Natasha of inappropriate physical contact. Mm -hmm. Natasha, accused. He groped me. No, I didn't. Okay, now, Mr. Rogers, respond in a way that makes everyone feel validated and heard. I have a whistle in my car. I like to find duality when conflict arises, you know, yin-yang sort of thing. I tend to be a pretty intense individual, so it's important for me to find inner peace in times of adversity. Um, that's a good start. Let's just keep it moving. Why is there a phone on the desk? Well, as a pizza club, you need to properly know how to order pizza. But also, you guys need to properly know how to have social interactions with each other without facial cues. So the scenario is a young African-American woman 
has recently split up from our boyfriend. This is making it increasingly difficult for you to order your menu items from her. So, respond in a way that makes her feel validated and heard. Oh, whatever, heifer! I don't care about your problems! Bring me my extra cheese! Whoa, racial stereotypes are not acceptable. We want to be kind and endearing. No. Wow, it's like someone has a case of the Mondays. It's Thursday. Uh, how do we do? Uh, A for effort. Effort doesn't have an A. I'll give you guys an A if you keep him on a dress code. All right. Uh, thank you. Okay. It's kind of like the DMV for collegiate recreational activities. Oh shit, I wasn't filming. Sorry! Oh my gosh! <laughs> <laughs> Got to. Oh, you are candid camera! You are candid camera! Wait, wait. You are candid so camera! You were filming oh that God, you are candid camera! Oh. <laughs> okay, alright. I gotta fix this deal about this. <laughs>